Because it's not about us, it's about the water, it's about the children and the animals and the future generations. I'm frightened. I'm frightened because I don't want any of you guys hurt. But we have to stand. We think that this is a slap in the face of, of uh, Indian Americans and the first Native Americans. We think that the uh, Trump administration should not uh, prioritize uh, political expediency and profit making um, and, uh, um, and, and undermine the treaty rights and the water rights of, of Indian people in this country. Uh, we think that uh, this pipeline uh, should go under a full review, environmental assessment and review with full consultation and participation of, of uh, people, uh, tribal people and people who are affected by the pipeline. It's Tuesday, January 24th. We're here at Ochete Oyate camp and we heard this morning that Donald Trump signed off on a Keystone XL and Dakota Access Pipeline and executive orders. Yes, and we would like Trump to know that we're still here as indigenous women. And we're not going anywhere. We're, we're going still going to stand in solidarity here at Standing Rock in prayer. We're not going anywhere. That's what we think about the executive order. And we're putting a call out to all the warriors. Come and stand in solidarity with us.